everyone. My name is William. I'm the Microsoft Student Partner for the University of Iowa. I'd like to take some time to demonstrate for you some of the new features found in the Zune 4.0 software update. We'll start off here by launching the application. And the first thing you're going to notice right off the bat is how incredibly fast it is to open. Now everything in the interface is just as snappy and responsive. Moving between any of the features or sections, you'll notice absolutely no lag. Um, at the home screen here, you'll notice that it's easy to navigate well laid out, all the information you'd want quick access to is provided in an easy and intuitive fashion. At the quick play menu, you get access to your new music and your history, and one of the new Zune 4.0 features is that if there's some artist or song or album that you absolutely love and just want instant access to the moment you open the program, you can actually right click that and select pin to quick play, and that'll add it to this section of the quick play menu over here, giving you instant access. Now one of my personal favorite features of the Zune 4.0 software is the Smart DJ. It creates an instant playlist of sorts that will play songs based off of a favorite artist similar to Pandora Radio but from your own music collection as well as from the Zune Marketplace. This is great for setting the mood at a party or just creating a quick mix for when you're studying. All you have to do is move your mouse over it and select um, the Play Smart DJ Mix. And that'll start the mix up. Now from this, you can um, selectively choose whether or not to include Zune Marketplace content or just content from your own library. Another great feature in the Zune 4.0 software is the mini player mode. It gives you access to some of the more basic features of the player um, without taking up the large amount of screen real estate that the full size player does. Another great thing about the Zune 4.0 software is that it's optimized for Windows 7. So if you go to the program icon and access as a jump list, um, you can actually get access to most of the same features you get from the mini player mode, like shuffling all of your music or just continuing playing your playlist. You also get that some of the even more basic features just by mousing over the program. You can pause, play, and resume songs. Um, now overall, I believe that the software is just a great update, and it gives you some really nice new features. And if you don't already have the Zune software, I suggest you at least give it a try, because it's a great way to manage your music, and the 4.0 update makes it even better. It's available for download from Zune.net. Now, if you already have the Zune software installed, the next time you launch it, you should just get a prompt for the update. 